Get comfortable. This is going to take a while. You don't like long rides? Let me help you with that. We're going down. Hold on to something. Darius, are you alright? Uh, I'll live. We should probably hurry. This elevator is barely holding on the ledge. These screws are pretty loose, but I need something thinner than my fingers. That residue again. I need my sword. It's stuck. Maybe I could lift the door off the hinges? Here we go. Come on! This elevator is going to fall any second now. Well, I guess we made it to the bottom floor. Somehow, I'm glad there's no sign of Sylvette. Let's take a look around. The wall is smooth, and that rod is too high to jump to. No use. That rod is too high. Looks good. Let's give it a shot. Be careful! I'm not so sure this was a good idea. Oh, crap! Oh, that was close. Almost there. I'll try to find something to get you across, Tara. If we could pull it from underneath this column, it would create a bridge for Tara. can't push it, but I could try to attach something heavy to pull it down into the abyss. Good throw! Try to undo the rope holding the chandelier. Whew, at 
worked. I'll push the left button. You take the other one. Come on, there's no time to waste. This must be Zaved's hideout. How are you holding up? Uh, I've been better. We were never too close, you know. My father loved my mother more than anything in the world. I was a result of that love. The labor was complicated, but she brought me into this world. Sadly, at the cost of her own life. Father always resented me for that. As the years have passed, we only moved further apart. But all things considered, I wish I'd had a chance for a proper goodbye. He seemed happy to see you before, you know. I think so too. Thank you, Tara. My king. Don't. To you, I'll always just be Darius. Why did you keep your identity a secret? Why not tell me you were the prince? The blood flowing through my veins always reminded me that sooner or later, I would take the mantle of the High King. But I spent most of my childhood on the streets. I had some friends among the common folk. It gave me a lot of perspective. I'd rather have people judge me by who I am and what I do, not by who my father is. Was. I think you're going to be a great king, Darius. Let's make sure that there is still a kingdom to rule over. Looks like it's working. No, it isn't. Let's try to pick it up. Barely roll it over. Tara, we could use that shape to create a copy of this strange key. I think I know the right recipe. That's an ether silver. It needs to be dissolved first. Spontaneous embers. That's a rare find. They could change a liquid to a solid in seconds if prepared properly. That's a unique puffball fungus. Its spores are desired by many alchemists.
You again? No matter. I'm almost done, and I won't let you interfere. Stop! Blast the door! We have to open it before he finishes the incantations. the same residue as we found in the elevator. That residue again. More gloomy jewels. Could climb that wall, but it's too far away. 
a pennant. I could use it to swing over the gap, but it stuck to that root. A long-ranged weapon would come in handy. Aim carefully. Still got it. Now let's hope that pennant holds. Oof. Now let's get up there. Here we go. Almost there. Got it. Tara, push the switch now. It's working. Come on, there's no time to waste. It's finished. Ah! Not until I breathe. No, serious. This it cannot be. I I can't. The power is overwhelming. Your prince is dead. Your genie and heart has fled. But you. You could serve me well. Renounce the light and kneel before me. Never, you monster! Very well. You fast. It's the dawn of the new age. Zavet! He's alive! Try some of this! He's weakened! Now's your chance, Tara! Sealed once more. You did it, Tara. No, we all did. And so the Shadow Lord was defeated once again. As soon as the tomb had closed, the tainted land of Persia began to heal. Freed from the grasp of the corruption, all the land's creatures found peace once again. Previously estranged from humans, Simurgs found new friends in Tara and her companions. Inu decided to stay with Orion for a while. More confident in her own abilities, she helped her own master to restore his world. She planned to go back to the university and finish her education, but somehow she never found her way there. Tara married High King Darius in a grand ceremony a couple of months after Zabed's downfall, becoming the Queen of Persia. The people were ecstatic to see how the king adored his new bride. And with the sunrise over Persia, this adventure draws to a close. But there will be more to come. <laughs>